So, I think I'm about tapped out with this, to be honest. Like, it's fun, but I can't sit here and play this all day. If I just, like, restart the game without staving, will they do something? Will they, like, fuss at me and get mad? Hey, uh, are you ready to hit the town? I don't think anything happened for me restarting this. Oh, shit! Hello, um, allow me to introduce myself. The name's Rossetti, Mr. Rossetti. Have we met before? At the post office, perhaps? Yeah, whatever. Anyway, let me just say thanks for buying this game, Animal Crossing. Um, on behalf of everyone at Nintendo, I, um, I... What was the next part? Huh? Ah, oh, forget it. That's enough. Let's get down to business, what do you say? Because you may not know it, but you and I got issues to discuss. First, let me just tell you what it is I'm doing here. Just so there are no misunderstandings later on. You, my friend, reset your game, didn't you? Huh? Maybe by accident, maybe on purpose, but you pressed it. Or maybe you didn't, huh? Maybe you just went and turned the power off without saving. Sound familiar? What? Sorry, what was that? I didn't catch that last bit. Did you just say I'm right? You did what I said you did? Aha! All right, you listen and listen good, because I get real angry when I gotta repeat stuff I gotta say. Resetting, it's like pressing an emergency call button. You press it and I gotta come read you the riot act, see? Also, you gotta save before you turn the power off. If you don't save, it's the same as resetting. Well, okay. That last part? I just added that. Why? Because I wanted to. Forget about other games for a minute, will ya? I'm here to suggest that you try and play this game, Animal Crossing, without hitting reset. Got it? I know what you're thinking. Whether I hit reset or not should be up to me. After all, it's my Nintendo GameCube. Well, I'm sorry. Rules are rules, okay? Know what I'm saying? Let's not make a big deal out of this. End of discussion. This being our first meeting, I'm gonna let you off easy. Think of this as a friendly warning from me to you. Oh, one more thing. This is my job. I take it seriously. So next time you see me, it's no more Mr. Nice Mole. Oh, yeah, and another thing. I guess I gotta say here. I really watched my language here today. I'm not usually quite so, you know, so polite. If I'm being truthful here, I gotta tell you, I've been told I got what you call an acid tongue. I sorta scare people. Hey, that's who I am. I can... nothing I can do about it. What, I'm supposed to be sorry for being me? Look, it's nothing personal. I ain't trying to be mean or cruel or nothing. I ain't a monster. For those people who get their feelings bruised easily, I gotta apologize in advance. Just deal with it, okay? The deal is, I get paid to be nasty. Crazy world, huh? Well, I figure it's about time for me to get out of here. So, uh, yeah. Here's hoping I don't have to come see you no more. Now... Scram! So we won't save, and we'll just, we'll just reset. Oh, jeez. Oh, here we go. You again, huh? <laughs> Alright, it worked. I should have known. I had a feeling about you. After all, wanting to do what you're told not to do is human nature. Listen, you get this whole reset thing started and you'll never stop. I've seen it a million times. You think this is a game? Well, okay, it is a game. But games got rules, and rules got consequences. Something funny to you? What am I doing over here? Stand up? You see an applause sign up in here? Look, don't make me come back here again. I'm serious. It ain't like I enjoy these little field trips. Next time you see me, I'm gonna be wearing my angry hat. And let me tell you, it's one ugly hat. Trust me on this one. When I get my motor going, you'll be here a while. Don't reset again. Now. Scram! You! <laughs> so where are you going, huh? Let me ask you something. What did you just do? Yeah, I'm talking to you. What do I mean? What do I mean? You trying to be funny? <laughs> resetting. I'm talking about you resetting the game. <laughs> Listen to me, Dine. You think you can fool me? You're fooling yourself. It ain't gonna happen. See, it's like this, alright? Whenever you reset, there's this light in the reset center that starts flashing. It's so bright. It hurts my brain. Now, don't get me wrong. I understand that you people make mistakes. It's genetic or something. Who knows? Maybe your finger slipped. I don't know, and I don't care. 
I don't know you and I don't care to know you. What I do want is for you to do me a favor. Yeah, do me a favor and answer this one question. Pray tell, is there a reset button in your world? There isn't, is there? Huh? Of course not. That would be stupid. Not being able to do things over again? That's called life, and you best get used to it. What? What was that? It's just a game? Don't make such a big deal out of it? That's what I'm talking about! Your attitude, it stinks! It's just a game, wah, what is that? I'll tell you what it is, it's pathetic. You ought to be ashamed. Huh? What's that? Speak up, you reset happy cheater! Are you telling me you never said that at all? <laughs> all right, maybe I had some dirt in my ears. Forget about it, let's move on. Let me just give you some examples of what I'm talking about, okay? And make sure you pay attention. Resetting over and over just to find an item or to erase an unfortunate incident? Sound familiar? Dine, this is just the kind of juvenile and disgusting style of gameplay that we want you to avoid. Where's the satisfaction in cheating through life? Take everything as it comes, it's in its own time. Enjoy it all. That's noble, that's graceful, and it's a whole lot easier to do in this game than it is in real life, let me tell you. Sigh. I bet you're asking yourself, how much longer is this guy gonna go on? You are, aren't you? Huh? Ah, uh, whatever. Attention span of a flea, that's what you got. All this jawing tired me out anyway. I'm gonna let you go, for now, anyway. But, you gotta promise me. No more. I'm serious here. Resetting is completely off limits! Oh, yeah, and one last thing. Take a bath. You got it? Now. Scram! One more time? Should we do it one more time? I'm gonna break this man. Oh, right, here we go. He's already out there! He's... Hey, you. Hold up a minute. Who? You? You, you, you! Don't pretend you don't know who I'm talking to, Dine. You ain't fooling nobody. Get your tail over here. You're a real piece of work, you know that? You think I was Blathers or the mayor or something? When I call you, I expect you to move, and I mean move. Um, what was that? That look you just gave me. What, may I ask, was that? Are you testing me? You don't want to do that. I'm warning you, you'll rue the day you moved here. And don't give me that crybaby what did I do look either. It ain't gonna fly, not with this mole. Reset, reset, reset. You just had to do it again, didn't you? <laughs> After all the kindness I've been showing you, you go and stab me in the back. What would your mother say? She'd say, what's a GameCube? Hey! You were gonna go and do it again, weren't you? Just now. Your finger was creeping over to reset. Stop! Just give it a rest, will ya? That's not gonna help you out of this jam. I'll just keep coming back. And stop wiggling around like you gotta go potty. You're driving me nuts. Just stand there and listen. I'm wasting my breath here, ain't I? I mean, look at you. You... you just don't listen. Is there something about this you maybe don't understand? Or is it just that you don't care at all? Is that it? Listen, Dine. I could stop and leave it to you how you, how you play. But where would that get us? Nowhere. How about playing a fantasy without any epic battles, no fighting against the odds to save some magical realm? Wouldn't it be nice to just lay down your sword, pick a few pretty daisies, and just be... nice? See my point? That ain't life, and this ain't a fantasy. I'm just asking that you enjoy life here, and all of its... Hey. Look at me when I'm talking to you! <laughs> oh my god. I can explain it to you, but I can't understand it for you, basically. If you hadn't reset in the first place, you wouldn't be here getting your tail chewed off. Okay, you ain't got a tail, but it's still your own fault. <laughs> you know, coming out here is no picnic for me either. It really wears a mole out. You think I'm joking? Look at that tunnel, will ya? I have to dig one of those each and every time you reset. I've only one mole. So how about you and I stop wasting each other's time? What do you say? No more resetting! Alright? We got an understanding? Oh, we got it. Well, alright then. As long as we're square, I'm satisfied. But this is the last time. So help me if I gotta do this just one more time. There's gonna be bad trouble. Oh, and before I forget, there's one last thing. Your hair. Wash it. Hey, fuck you, Rossetti. We clear? Now. Scram! 
we told him that we understood, okay? And we get it. We're sorry. So we're gonna do it again. There he is. Wait, who's this? Don? What? What's the deal with that thunder? That really startled me bad. Seriously. Oh, um, anyway, I ought to say it's nice to meet you. I'm Rossetti's older brother. My name's Don. Yeah, my brother Sonny can be a real head case. Thanks for putting up with his, uh, quirks. Yeah, quirks. So, Sonny had an urgent errand that he just couldn't pull himself away from. The guy's like a mole dynamo. So I came in his place. Thanks for opening up time in your busy schedule to have a little talk with me. So anyway, if I might begin at the beginning, it seems that our Sonny's been going off the deep end once again. He's been popping up all over the place. You know, yelling at people and getting right in their faces and causing havoc. On behalf of the family, I apologize. I know I'm his brother, but I'm sincere when I say that despite his, uh, outbursts, he's, uh, he's a good kid. He's a bit enthusiastic and, uh, kinda overbearing. You could even say he's pig-headed. Mole-headed? Either way, his social skills are real, real unpolished, and his choice of language is, shall we say, questionable. But don't forget his heart. It's in the right place. Trust me, there ain't an evil bone on his body. So, uh, just let him have his little say and shrug it off. Don't hold it against him. He don't get out much. Oh, yeah, right. Business. I guess I gotta take care of a little business, right? I don't want to get yelled at. Okay, here goes nothing. Do... Do re me. <laughs> Ahem. Um, resetting is no good. Don't do it, Dine. The resettees suggest giving up your resetting ways for health reasons. Got it? Hmm. Guess that should cover it. About time for me to make tunnels. See you around. And good luck. Now... Scram! He was much more polite about it. Oh! Look at that. Oh, no, we can't. <laughs> I thought I was going to get away. Think you're getting away with that? You got another thing coming. Stop resetting. Hear me? What don't you get? Ha. Ah. Oh, phew. All that screaming at you. Everything went all black. You see what you're doing to me? To my health? Huh? You know, you're the only one who pushes it this far. The only one who fails to understand. Only you. You listening to me? Because it looks to me like I got to go through this whole song and dance again. When the reset alarm sounds, somebody's got to just drop everything and investigate. And that somebody's me. Yeah, I know. It's my job, and I got to deal with it. I ain't looking for sympathy. But for crying out loud, it don't matter if I'm eating, taking a hot mud bath, reading Mo Monthly, or catching some Z's. When that alarm goes off, I gotta stop what I'm doing and start digging like it was National Digging Day. I know you can't see it from up there, but I'm only wearing one sock. One! Who lives like this? This job ain't glamorous, let me tell you. Hey, you laughing at me? You can't be laughing at me. I swear, just now, your nose, it twitched. Yeah, I saw it. Your ugly little pug nose. It was twitching like mad. Okay, that's how you want it? All right, I see how it is. The chickens are coming home to roost now, ain't they? If that's how you want to play, then that's how we'll play. You know, I can see you forgetting yourself and resetting once, maybe twice. It could happen, I guess. But this time, no two ways about it. It was deliberate. A calculated, cold-blooded act of villainy by a punk. No more forgive and forget Rossetti for you, pal. Oh no. Until you show me some real regret, I ain't leaving. All right, what to do? They don't exactly cover hoodlums like you in the reset prevention manual. Asking, you got that? Ain't working. All that gets me is lip service, so we both know what that's worth. Hmm, got it. Yeah, that's good. Okay, listen up, troublemaker. Here's what we're gonna do. No more of your worthless, I'm sorry, Mr. Rossetti garbage. Now you're gonna have to say exactly what I tell you to. You screw it up, you do it again. Let's see. Yeah, that'll work. You ready? Here goes. Say, me equals bad. Frig. Off. Wrong! <laughs> nope, no way, twerp. Do it over. Try again. You ready? Here goes. Say, me equals bad.
Oh, this is genius. Where the fuck's the equal sign? It's like getting punished in school. No, I didn't want that. <laughs> How do I change to the uh, to the equal sign? Aha, uh -huh. okay. Okay. I got it now. <laughs> no, wait. No, I just had it. Where'd it go? There we go. Equals. Come on, right, booty? No, this is this, this is a struggle. There, you're being sincere, right? You really, truly, no joke. Cross your heart, hope to die, mean it. Well, do you, punk? That thing you just said, don't forget it. Yeah, there was a space. Well, all right then. As long as you and I are clear on that, I'm one happy, snappy mole. But for the love of dirt, no more. It stops here. Oh yeah, one last thing. Before you go to bed, brush those teeth, will ya? Understood? Now. Scram! Should we do it again? He literally just made us right on the board. Can I run? Nope. Gra! <laughs> you again! Stop! Jerkin! My chain! <laughs> What's it gonna take to make you stop? Uh, Oh. Uh, uh. Mm, phew. Alright, Dine. That's it. Today's the day. I'm done. No more taking it easy on the poor human. See, I understand you now. It took a while, but I finally see what makes you tick. Allow me to elaborate, huh? The whole reset thing? It's your decision, right? Yeah, freedom of choice and all that. You're the master of your own destiny and blah 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 blah. That's all fine with me. I'm just tired of the drama. He's the one causing the drama. You want to hit reset, right? You love doing that, huh? That's what you really want to do? Well, if that's what you're really looking for, let me help you out. Yeah, no problem. I'll hit reset for you. Everything you've done so far? All that you've worked for? Forget about it. That's right. It's all going bye-bye. You, my button-happy friend, get to start over. Well, see ya! <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> How you like them apples? Did we break our controller? Did we maybe kick our TV? <laughs> I got your attention now, Dine, huh? Did I knock a little sense into you? All the lights on up there? You keep going this way and bad things may happen. You don't want to make me any angrier. Do you? Anyway, no more being stupid. Stop with the reset business, alright? Are we clear? No way. What? <laughs> you wise off. You want to play like that, and I'll reset the whole mess. Everything. Poof. Gone. Don't think I won't. Is that what you want? Huh? That make you happy? No, I didn't think so. Too much work for me, too. Anyway, no more being stupid. Stop with the reset business. Alright? Are we clear? No way. Grah. What's it gonna take to get you to understand this? You need a reset tutor or something like that? Come on. I got some clothes in the wash. I gotta get back. If I don't get them out quick and get them hung up to dry, they're gonna be wrinkled up worse than old Tortimer. Plus, they'll reek of mold. And then I'll have to come back here and mold you. Anyway, no more being stupid. Stop with the reset business, alright? Are we clear? No way. Huh? What was that? I don't think I could have heard you correctly. I'm gonna ask you again. Anyway, no more being stupid. Stop with the reset business, alright? Are we clear? Got it. That's what I want to hear. As long as we've got an understanding, we can wrap this up and put it to bed. But I'm not even joking about this. No more of this funny business, you hear me? Oh, yeah, one last thing. Before you tuck yourself into bed later tonight, scrub behind those ears. You got potatoes growing. Got that? Now. 
Scram. My cheeks are sore from laughing. Please, just once, I promise for real, this is the last time, just once. We're gonna kill the man. We're, we're gonna kill Rossetti. <laughs> he can't take it anymore. Grah! Dine! Blue in the face, and you still don't get it. What's wrong with you? <laughs> uh, no reset. That means you. Don't give me any lip. You're the one causing all the problems. Hey, you're doing it again. Hey, you, idiot. He called me an idiot! I thought I made it clear I want you to look at me when I'm talking to you. I said look at me, Dine, now. Oh my god. Whoa. I never noticed before, but you got some nice eyes. Yeah, real hypnotic. Seti, calm down. Let me tell you something, Dine. This ain't about you personally, but more about the world in general. People see something they don't want to see, and for whatever reason, they pretend they don't see nothing. People see a problem they don't want to deal with, and they pretend they're too busy to be bothered. This sort of tendency is spreading like a disease. It's real tragic to say, but that's the world we live in. Don't that seem sort of all messed up to you? I mean, closing your eyes, hoping that all the bad stuff is just going to go away and not bother you no more? That's... that's what babies do. You hearing me? Infants. You see what I... Huh? Hey! Hey! Tyne, wake up! Oh my god, that face. That's fucking nightmare fuel. I'm talking over here. This is some serious stuff. You got no manners at all, you thumb-sucking twerp. Grah! That's it. It's go time. This mole's had enough. Time to pay the piper. My patience gauge is now officially on empty! And the anger gauge is way in the red zone. You and your smug little devil-may-care attitude, I'm gonna tunnel through your house! <laughs> Yo! Erk, massive leg cramp. Blood pressure skyrocketing. Phew. I'm not supposed to get so worked up, you know? My doctor, she warned me about this kind of stuff. Well, that's it. No more. I'm done for today. I'm going home. Trying to keep you in check is bad for my health. No more resetting. I'm serious here. Oh, yeah, one last thing. Every now and then, go to bed early. Staying up late all the time is for chumps. You got it? Now. Scram! <laughs> that was worth it. That one more time was absolutely worth it. <laughs> that was funny. We're gonna let him rest, yeah. Yeah, my cheeks are sore. That was, that was, that was good.